Hi everyone, today I will be speaking about hot edges. Uh, these are used in shape extrusion and you will see uh, how to use them and what benefits they have. So let me create a shape extrusion through a shape extrusion template and then replace the circle being used as the extruded shape by a rectangle. And here you will see that uh, the light area blends gradually into the dark area which looks weird because this happens usually with smooth surfaces and a rectangle being extruded is not a smooth surface it should look like this so here you can see uh, an abrupt change in uh, the lighting and uh, this looks more natural by taking the hard edges uh, parameter here you are saying that this shape extrusion will take into consideration any hard edges in the extruded uh, shape but you have first to create them or make sure that they do exist in that shape so uh, by creating a rectangle uh, through the shape wizard or through this module uh, the hard edges are already set uh, but if you create your own shape uh, your own custom shape then you have to uh, set it up let me show you how this is done so by clicking on the select here I select the shape used for the extrusion and you can see that for each one of the four corners we have a script called meta cg options cg stands for curvy generator and in this script uh, you can define for each one of the control points uh, you can define parameters that are used in the curvy generator for the extrusion so the one we are using here is hard edge so you can see that for example if i choose this one and, and tick hard edge here things look smooth and now they look hard again uh, and so this is how you set this parameter in your control points and once they are set you can either choose to ignore them or use them by clicking by setting this parameter in this module uh, as you can see you have uh, in this uh, uh, in these options you have other options uh, like a way to define a per control point material id or uh, per control point uv coordinates override the default <coughs> uv coordinates so you can learn more about how those are used uh, if you go to the documentation by clicking on the question mark here and same here for this module and its uh, related options uh, so that's it i hope that this was helpful and have a nice day